research here at McEwen is actually in collaboration uh, right now with the University of Hawaii at the Hawaii Institute of Marine Biology. And what I do with uh, that institute is actually we look at uh, family relationships between corals. So we look at how they're related uh, and how that impacts upon uh, environmental uh, preserves. So if you're going to set up a marine preserve and you want to know, hey, we want to set up a marine preserve in this area, are the corals endangered that are in here or are they not? Right? Well, how do you tell the differences between the corals? And a lot of what we've been finding recently uh, is that some species of coral, uh, such as ones within Montipara, uh, look very similar, and they may be similar species, but sometimes they look different, and they're still the same species. So that's very interesting results. Um, well, what I've done here actually is I'm going to be expanding upon that kind of research because obviously I don't get to go to Hawaii all the time because um, it's a ways away to travel to. Uh, but what I've done here is started to set up this coral tank, and you can work with corals in what they call captive coral propagation, or growing them in uh, what they call uh, marine reef tanks uh, in a landlocked situation, similar to a miniature version of a big public aquarium reef system. And what I'm doing here is establishing various coral species to look at and study, not only with some of the aspects of um, DNA and family relationships, but also looking at aspects of basic biology. So the research will be really wide uh, for students to get involved in. And I'm interested in working with students because they can work on basic biology, what makes certain species of coral grow more than others. Uh, and they can also look at more detailed things of the DNA or molecular biology if they want to. Um, well, I'm running a marine biology course or teaching it. Uh, the department's offering it. And uh, that comes up in the winter of uh, this year coming up 2012, winter 2012. And so in that course uh, we look at a lot of the aspects of uh, marine reef systems. Uh, we also look at general marine biology, which is very general because anything studied in the ocean that's uh, living really is uh, marine biology. So it's a great course. I have only taught it once uh, and this will be my second time, but the first cohort of students I went through last year really gave uh, positive feedback. On so this is just behind the scenes with the tank, and this is actually designed, uh, this whole room is designed so that students can work on projects, because what we're really interested in is introducing students in biology uh, to research, right, and how you can uh, use it quite actively in the area of marine biology and also fresh water. Uh, and you can see a variety of systems here, but you can see up above are some small tanks, and these small tanks are going to be ones that students can work with and experiment with coral with uh, from the main tank. Um, there's many aspects of basic biology students can look at with uh, corals that are still unknown.